Hello everyone, my name is Anthony Zolo. I'm the Assistant Superintendent for Educational Services at the North Rockland Central School District. Like many districts throughout the nation, the COVID pandemic has created a series of obstacles in which we collectively had to find ways to overcome. It's also created certain opportunities for us. Here at North Rockland, we've been examining a new approach to our summer programs for some period of time. What we've looked to do is create an environment in which students would feel more welcome about coming back to school and in doing that, increase their engagement, their participation, and hopefully eagerness to begin the 2021-2022 school year. Traditional summer programs you're familiar with. Students that participated would go in and sit for their math class, they would sit for their science class. What we've decided to do is take the technology component, take the STEM component, and place science and math with the help from physical education under that umbrella. Let's take a moment to take a closer look at the summer programs that were availed at Fieldstone Middle School. Stepping Stones was our chance to think out of the box this year. It's not pencil and paper at the desk all day long. The kids are up and out and moving and doing STEM projects. The Stepping Stones program for all three grades is skills-based, project-based, and it's more about student engagement. For the sixth grade going to seventh grade, they're doing a project-based program called Shark Tank. It was really meant to be an opportunity for students to get to collaborate with each other and really take ownership over a project. So essentially they were the ones coming up with the idea for the project creating a pitch for the project and eventually making a model or a prototype of the product. My favorite part about the Shark Tank maybe is working with the group. My favorite part was pretty much like creating new things or make things that already exist much better. It's cross-curriculum. It involves STEAM, ELA, social studies, math, science, art, music. It's a really good idea the way you have that attached to the actual bag. And it's been such a challenging year for many of our students and the fact that they were able to work together, come up with creative ideas, stand out in front of their, their peers and their teachers and, um, and present their product, it was, it was wonderful. For the seventh and eighth grade, something that's unique for us is we brought in this 4D motion. 4D motion is a portable 3D motion capture system. So we can put sensors on people and actually create 3D renderings like a video game. But we're really excited about the opportunity to use this technology to teach kids STEM. And what's great about this piece of technology is that we can collaborate against a whole bunch of other subjects with our math and science teachers. Um, instead of just grabbing data from thin air when they're doing their equations or comparing information, we're actually using the information from the captures uh, for our students. So they really get a real hands-on approach. This is the three-pointer much higher rate. But you can also see the angle, so he happened to miss that one. We also did vertical jump the last couple days where showing them how fast their knee went from flexion to extension. So if a kid wants to improve their explosiveness, we can now can create a program for them. My favorite part about the Step and Stone program is math and science because they like combined it into like one thing and you make it fun for us. You have two minutes to knock off the can from the table many times as possible. You throw a frisbee and you have to bring it back but without using your hands. So you throw it and you have to pull it. I made this invention that you have to pull it back with the other people in the group. It's gym and STEM so you get a workout and you get a learning activity too. The response of the kids have been fantastic. I didn't think they knew that they were going to have a gym class and STEM projects and get outside use the 4D motion stuff, so that was a complete surprise and it's been nice to see the attendance. A lot of kids have been coming and looking forward, very energetic. As in many instances, North Rockland is extremely excited to pioneer new ideas in regards to student programming. Student and staff response has been an overwhelming success. What we're looking to do is continue to look at revolutionary ideas in instruction as we move forward into the future.